Hey guys, with the pending servo motor upgrade on the Precision Matthews, I thought it would be a good opportunity to take a look at my CNC control software. I can remember just a few years ago when I got started, there really wasn't a lot of options available as far as CNC control software. You basically had Mach 3 and Linux CNC. Now Mach 3 was really popular because it was Windows based. I currently run Mach 3 on all three of my machines and Mach 3 is really limited when it comes to servo motors. Uh, the kernel speed that you can get out of a Mach 3 using the parallel port is just not going to be good enough for servo motors. Linux CNC on the other hand of course is Linux based was then and is still today a very capable and more powerful platform. So it's a good option for servo motors however it's still PC based. Uh, we now have UC CNC available again is Windows based software. Centroids a manufacturer of industrial CNC controllers has recently came out with a Acorn CNC controller that is geared more towards the do-it-yourself CNC enthusiast like myself and it's a great option however it is limiting with only uh, eight inputs and outputs uh, you still have to have a computer to run the software but it has a real good price point and I think in the future it may be more capable but right now with the projects I have coming up and the things that I want to do with the Precision Matthews uh, it's just not going to be enough for a fourth axis and a ATC the way it is currently it's only a four axis controller now I've recently saw a lot of standalone CNC controllers uh, on eBay and they're pretty popular with some of the Chinese made CNC machines and you can pick these 5 axis controllers up for about twelve or thirteen hundred dollars with shipping. Uh, they're plug and play, there's no computer needed, uh, all the software is built in which really is a nice feature to have. And then about, I would say, a year and a half ago, Hein Technology came out with the Masso CNC controller. And this is something that is really different to the market. Uh, it's an all-in-one solution to your CNC control software. It has your breakout board, your software, computer, everything is built in. And it has a lot of nice features that I'm really interested in. It has 32 isolated inputs, 16 TTL logic outputs, has outputs for the spindle control, 5 axis, and 7 relay outputs. So it has plenty of inputs and outputs for what I'm going to do with my mill. I can run my ATC, a fourth axis, and several other uh, peripherals if need be. One thing I really like about the Masso is the price point. If you were to add up individually all the different components that you're going to need with a PC based controller, you're going to spend well over the Masso cost. A 5-axis controller for a Masso is $575. You add up a PC and a breakout board, smooth stepper that you'll need for Mach 3 or Mach 4, uh, and you're going to be well over that. So I thought if I'm going to do the servo motor upgrade, why not upgrade my control software? And I pretty much limited it to two different choices either Linux CNC or a Masso and I went with the Masso because it, I like the 
fact that it's cutting edge technology, plenty of inputs and outputs, super fast boot speed, very compact, and has plenty of inputs and outputs for what I'm going to be needing. Stay tuned in future videos and uh, we'll take a more in-depth look at the Masso controller. It's going to be a while before I get my cabinet wired and powered up so stay tuned for some little snippet videos. If you have any questions or suggestions please feel free to comment. If you're interested in the Masso CNC controller stop by and visit their website. I'll post the link in the video description. If you're interested in any of my CNC conversion plans, you can stop by my website and you'll, you can find those. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Thumbs up if you like the video. And most importantly, be safe.